Hello Gemini, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to your reading. So please keep in mind that this is a general reading. I know I'll resonate for everyone. Okay, so I've decided to do a totally different spread. Okay, so let's get started. For Gemini, <clears throat> love message, please, Spirit. What message for Gemini's love situation? What message, please, for Gemini's love situation? Ooh, at the bottom we have the Hierophant. So we have the Hierophant here. It could be with the Taurus. So stability, security, someone gaining wisdom in this connection. <clears throat> someone not willing to in invest. And we have the Eight of Wands. Someone might want to communicate with you, reach out to you, move towards you because they want commitment with you. Okay, let's see. For Gemini's present situation, we have... The hermit, so you could be deal with a Virgo, but this is someone who has done a lot of reflection. Yeah, someone possibly has gained wisdom in this situation, okay? A lot of reflection. Someone could have, you know, <clears throat> been in isolation. Someone withdrew from this connection to do a lot of reflection, to find some sort of guidance, inner work, shadow work here, okay? We're going to clarify everything afterwards, okay? So for the potential or for the obstacle, we have the emperor. Someone definitely gained wisdom, leveled up. That's the potential here. Someone is more stable now. Could be with an Aries. But the emperor is all about commitment, stability. Okay. He's a leader. He's very family oriented. Okay. For the recent past, that queen of pentacles so there's a virgo taurus capricorn or uh, a mother figure someone who is very nurturing okay this could be you here so we're going to cl clarify everything afterwards so you could have given a lot to the situation okay if this you're this queen of pentacles you're very giving very loving in this connection maybe you didn't get the same in return Let's see, for the focus, for the focus here, the Five of Cups. So someone here misses you, okay? It's the focus of this connection. They're, they're definitely in their minds about this. The loss, the disappointment, the regret. Someone's in a, you know, in um, not in a good head space here. It's a very pessimistic, you know, type of energy here. Yeah, someone's not doing well here without this connection. Let's see. For the near future, for the near future, the Two of Cups. So mutual love. Definitely a, a strong connection here. <clears throat> okay, so we'll clarify afterwards for what you should know. The Wheel of Fortune. Someone wants change. Someone wants positive change. Yeah. Someone's at the five of cups, you know, they want to, to move to, from negative to positive here in a positive direction. They want this two of cups here to move in a positive direction. <clears throat> they want to release possibly this, you know, the burns, the, the, you know, the difficulties and just change, you know, and the cycle that didn't work out and start a new cycle for the outcome. The Ten of Pentacles. Look at that. Stability, long-term. Someone, yeah, someone sees long-term potential with you. Definitely here. This is pretty clear. I mean, I'm going to clarify, but this is so clear, right? So, for the Hermit in the present situation, why is the Hermit here? The High Priestess. So, someone is definitely <clears throat> gaining some sort of wisdom here. Okay, someone's following their intuition about this connection, okay, to have clarity. So at this moment, someone's going within to find some clarity and their intuition is screaming at them. It's a very high here that this is the connection, that this queen of pentacles, that you are the one for them, okay. They'll definitely be enlightened about you, about this connection. Why is the High Priestess here? The Ace of Swords. I mean, how much clarity can you have here? The Hermit, the High Priestess, and the Ace of Swords. So they'll definitely want to communicate with you, 
have the talk maybe you can talk about okay and then you know they'll find some clarity and then possibly clear the air between you two it could be trust issues because the ace of sword is here so maybe this person lied to you in the past okay now they want to clear the air they want to come towards they want this new beginning where it's going to be you know um honest they're going to be authentic they don't want to lie to you anymore yeah and they're following their heart's desire they're following their intuition towards this connection there's two of cups this is very beautiful why is the emperor here why is the emperor here the hierophant again so a lot of potential here potential for stability potential for commitment potential for someone gaining wisdom here yeah this someone's definitely awakening to this connection here if they did not see this connection in the past they see it now why is the hierophant here why is the hierophant here the empress look at this the emperor the empress and in between stability and i mean this could even lead to marriage here you were meant to be you were destined to be together this is definitely a soul connection here you were definitely destined this is destiny right here with that wheel of fortune <clears throat> destined to be together so for the queen of pentacles let's clarify the queen of pentacles the ace of cups so someone you know this they might want it now with you okay In the recent past they could have realized after having all this clarity that they do want this with you but possibly in the recent past they have rejected this okay this was offered to them okay you could have offered your love they did not appreciate it they did not want it okay because they didn't see it before they see it now but not not in the past so there could have been a rejection of this ace of cups in the past but they definitely do want it now why is the ace of cups here the sun yeah so i feel like you know <clears throat> they realize th there's clarity here look at all this clarity the sun the hermit the high priest of the ace of swords and they see happiness with you they want that ace of cups because they see that happiness with you it could be with a leo <clears throat> but you know you make them happy this is the happiest card of the deck it could be vice versa right because you could be mirroring one another two of cups you know and this is a destined connection so you might also feel the same way so let's see the focus there's the five of cups here why is the five of cups here the four of wands yeah someone is definitely missing you missing this connection they're they could be obsessing about this right about what they've lost a lot of potential here four of wands the hierophant the ten of pentacles why is the harf the sorry why is the four of wands here why is the four of wands here that king of swords so could be with the gemini libra aquarius this could be you masculine or feminine doesn't matter but yeah so they miss you right <clears throat> they miss you and um they miss this connection definitely you're definitely on their minds here okay if this is your person then there's a determination here to get to this connection there's a lot of determination now they know now they know what they want okay they don't know it in the past they know what they want now and they know where they're headed with this yeah there's a lot of determination to get to this connection why is the two of cups here let's clarify the two of cups why are the two of cups here the seven of cups okay so i feel they're looking at ways you know in the near future they could be looking at ways to make this possible okay this connection possible yeah <clears throat> Why is the seven of cups here? Why is the seven of cups here? The page of cups. Oh, okay. I see. Okay. So someone could have had options here in this connection. So what's going to happen in the near future is that they're going to apologize here. So they did not make in the past. Yeah. This person did not make this, you know, a priority. This was a priority to them. Whatever was going on in these other cups. So 
this person's attention was in other situations, other people, you know, there's definitely third party interference here. Okay. So yeah, this is what this person, you know, focused in the past. Now they want to apologize for that because now, because now they see this two of cups. Now they're making this a focus. Okay. Now they're focusing on this and they want to apologize for possibly, you know, not giving to this connection. Okay. So Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy here. There's definitely going to be communication here. There's the Ace of Swords, there's the Eight of Wands, and there's that Page of Cups. So let's clarify that Wheel of Fortune. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? The Chariot. Look at all this. This is in what you should know. This person wants to come in towards you. They want to change things. They want to move this in a positive direction. So this was it could have been out of control this person was out of control with all that seven of cups okay with all of you know other options all these other cups they're taking control of a situation could be with a cancer but they're definitely taking control of the situation and moving this in a positive direction i'm not even going to clarify this further so the outcome the ten of pentacles i i don't think i'm gonna you know really clarify this because this is so obvious really obvious this person wants long-term commitment and nothing less you know long-term stability good foundation and like i said you're destined to be together and i ma marriage is a possibility here strong possibility definitely <clears throat> So that's it, Gemini. So I hope it resonated with you. I hope you enjoyed your reading. Take care.